video, I'm going to show you how to extract star anise pods or seeds into a concentrated tea with higher levels of shikimic acid. Shikimic acid, also found in pine needles, is the active ingredient in Tamiflu, the antiviral drug. Star anise is also another great property. It smells like black licorice and has many other helpful properties for your health that I don't mention here. I'll have all the supplies you see here linked below in the description. As well as being an antiviral, shikimic acid in the star anise is also known to help reduce blood platelet aggregation, also known as blood clotting. If you've been researching natural products to help with natural immunity during the SARS-CoV pandemic, this is probably how you found this video. You may also already know COVID produces spike proteins. And also the reaction in the vaccine can cause spike proteins. They are the agent that we're trying to reduce here in a natural way. Star anise seeds or pods are very expensive. They're right now, they're about $1.50 to $2 a pound. And I buy mine through Amazon by the pound. And uh, obviously the more you buy, the cheaper you can get it. So I'll have a link to this in the description below as well. To get on with the process, you need a few things. You'll need a coffee grinder. And you can either use the electric type here or the manual type. I've got both of those linked in the description. You'll need an espresso maker, just a cheap one will work. This one's a Mr. Coffee brand, but any brand works. They're about 50 bucks. And then of course you'll need the uh, star anise seeds or pods. Also, uh, you'll need some filtered water and a measuring cup and then a jar to store your final concentrated refrigerated liquid. My preferred mix for the tea is roughly three pods per cup, and that's, that'd be an eight ounce cup if you're just grinding these up and seeping them in, in a tea. Um, but with this concentrate method, you can put nine of these pods into the espresso maker and make it concentrated so that you don't have to do it every day. And um, one of these jars with eight ounces of the concentrated liquid will equal about three cups of appropriately flavored. So the first thing you wanna do in the process is take about nine of these seed, seed pods and put them in the uh, coffee grinder. Grind them up. So you can see as that does a really good job of uh, making it into a uh, Not a fine grind, but uh, kind of a medium that will work well in the espresso machine and filter out the properties that you need. So next we're gonna take the espresso filter basket and we're going to put the ground seed pods in. attach it to the espresso maker. And then we're going to put in eight ounces of filtered water. Lid on. Set the measuring cup underneath. And then just turn on the switch. While we're waiting for this thing to heat up, and through the process, I also wanted to point out some other free radical 
uh, supplements to get rid of free radicals like the spike protein, one of which is black seed oil. And um, if you look at the ingredients, some of that may seem familiar. I'm not going to go into a lot of that right now, but you can do your own research, and I'll have links to these in the description as well. Also, the um, another free radical uh, natural supplement is the NAC or N-acetylcysteine. Those are both high rated in this goal that we're after here. Okay, so this thing's just about done. And we're gonna relieve the pressure. So as I was saying, I found that three pods per eight ounces makes a good, not too strong tasting tea, but you can experiment to find your preference. This method of extraction pulls more of the shikimic acid out of the base pods than just steeping in regular tea. Hope you enjoyed the video and learned something. Please follow the links below in the description. They help support my channel by using Amazon affiliate links. Please subscribe and give a thumbs up if you feel like it. And have a great day. Thanks for watching.